Now back to the Lori Moore Show, only on your CW7. This segment is brought to you by Vitality Healthcare. Today we're talking about the weight loss component of this and joining us, two people, the founder of Vitality Healthcare, speaker for Foundation of Wellness Professionals, member of the American Academy of Anti-Aging Medicine and American Academy of Environmental Medicine and board certified clinical nutritionist, Dr. Stephen Osterhout and weight loss advocate at Vitality Healthcare, Trina Madonia. Welcome to both of you. Thank, Thank you. you. It's been fun learning about what you're all about Give us an overview of your philosophy. Well, again, you know my approach. My approach is to integrate the best conventional medicine with the best natural medicine. And we have to look at all aspects of health. And one significant aspect of health in today's society is weight. It's a significant issue. And I don't think it's as easy as, at least when I remember weight loss, when I was growing up around my family, is exercise and watch what you eat. I think there's metabolic diseases going on now. There's environmental factors at play. We have insulin resistance and diabetes, blood sugar fluctuations, high blood pressure, cholesterol issues. And of course, we know that that thyroid is usually involved in this dynamic too. And if we have a sluggish thyroid, we know that all those cells in your body that use that thyroid to turn up the burner, it's not happening. So that has to be addressed. So with our integrated approach, we take that information and then we combine it. We, we collaborate with our medical approach for weight loss. And Trina's here and she has a great, she's an advocate for our weight loss. She knows it in and out. You can get people through the program. What Absolutely. makes this different? We hear about all kinds of different weight loss programs. What makes this unique? Well, I really feel like what makes our program unique is that it is so individualized. We have a very thorough screening process. We're medically supervised. We offer comprehensive blood work as well. So we can direct our patients toward the program that they're going to be the most successful at. Our goal really is the prevention of disease processes. So while we want our patients to look good and feel good, we want them to be healthy long-term. We have some examples of people who have gone through the program. Tell us their yes. stories. Well, so we see a lot of patients who, again, like Dr. Osterhout said, have sluggish thyroids. This is a patient, Sarah, who's had 40 pounds of weight loss and weaned off of several, several medications, which those are always our favorite stories um, because the quality of life is improved and her risk of further disease process is diminished. And this is Joel. Joel lost about 50 pounds during our program. Still, at this point, he is over 72 pounds of weight loss with the tools that he learned and can implement on his own. Give us an example of some of these tools that you're mentioning. So depending upon that um, screening process and the consultation with our medical provider, we can implement things such as hormonal therapy, short-term appetite suppressants, nutrition, detoxification protocols. We have a lot of different opportunities for our patients and they're really aimed at patients losing weight quickly because that's how we stay motivated, but really long-term success. And nutritional counseling is yes, a big part of absolutely. what you do. We do and our patients thrive on that accountability. So they do come in once a week and sit down with our nutritional coach. They will help guide them through challenges, give them tips, ideas for meal prep, and really provide encouragement along the way. Are there any side effects to what people do with well, you? Well, other than happiness, happiness <laughs> better mood, better sleep. Yes. And yeah, all of those things. It's really true. And looking fantastic. Doctor, do people usually, you know, get to a point where they've been diagnosed with diabetes or something, or, you know, even some cancers are now being blamed on being overweight. Yes. Does it usually take something like that for some people to make a change? Unfortunately, we see that quite a oh, bit. Yeah. It would be nice if everybody was just motivated on their own, and we appreciate it if you are, but we also appreciate if sometimes you, you have to be a little bit motivated from a diagnosis. And so that's, uh, we're there. That's why this integration is so wonderful for our office. We can handle that condition that you come in with while we're trying to lose weight. We can also manage that health issue. Trina, you yeah. say you have a favorite story. You talked about how you love hearing people being able to chuck the medications. Yes, tell us, absolutely. Tell us one of your success well, stories. So one of our biggest success stories is a, a long-term patient of ours, Judy, and she actually was able to wean off of all of her type 2 diabetes medications, and her doctor actually took that diagnosis off of her medical record. So she is no longer a diabetic after going through our program. 
I was reading some of the testimonials on yes. your website, and some people are saying they're going to their doctor. They're saying, the doctor's saying, what did you do? You're right. And they say, <laughs> you. Well, and that's often what we find. People will come in and say, I need help. My doctor told me I need to lose weight, but I don't know how. They don't give them the tools to lose the weight, and that's our focus. Are men and women different oh. in weight yes. loss? Well, that, yes. <laughs> yeah. It's true. Yeah. That, yeah. <laughs> Is it a different approach for Not a different women? approach. Um, men, unfortunately, always can jump the gun and drop those pounds faster. Yeah. It's, it's just, not fair. It is, is it not true? fair, but it is just the way it goes. <laughs> we, may, we navigate that dynamic. We all get to the same point at the end. Very good. So if people are interested in just weight loss, would they sure. immediately make an appointment with you? or you, or the office, or yeah, how does that work? Absolutely. We do offer a complimentary consultation, so they can come in and sit down with a health, a health coach and go through a screening, and we can start the process of steering them in the proper direction. Vitality Healthcare is in Portage. Doctor, you tell me if people are watching from outside the immediate area, though, you can give them advice, too. You better believe it. The, the whole idea, again, in our philosophy, is to make sure that everybody has an opportunity to know that these these conditions can be navigated with other approaches, safe approaches, and we can coordinate care. And we can call you at your office, find you in Portage yes. on Oakland Drive. Excellent. We can also find you on Facebook. Yes. Thank you both so much for being here Thank you. and telling us about Thanks. this. Thank you. Our trivia question today, these workers in 1936 Kalamazoo had a hot job. They're baking enamel onto one of Kalamazoo's most popular products ever at a temperature of 1,800 degrees. What factory is this? We'll tell you when we come back on The Lori Moore Show on your CW7. Follow The Lori Moore Show on Facebook.